you for joining us. I'm Alexandra Meacham. A home invasion and robbery at a home in West Shreveport leads to a fatal shooting this morning. Fox 33's Shirley Busco is at the scene. It's tonight's top story. It's frustrating. Um, it's it's a never ending cycle, it seems. Just before 10 a.m., someone broke into a Barbara Avenue home and was shot while attempting to rob the people inside. Police say 25 year old Regiment Mitchell was found dead in a car in the driveway. Second officer on scene, they said there's a guy sitting in a car that's been shot. Um, at which point, the officer did find uh, one black male in the, in the vehicle uh, suffering from a single gunshot wound. Police say it is unknown how Mitchell got to the car after he was shot inside of the home. We come to work and we deal with this over and over again. Um, doesn't matter if we have enough manpower to answer the call. We're trying to grab officers from every other area to help us work these calls just repeatedly over and over again. And it saddened me because I don't like, you know, I don't like for nobody to lose their life behind gun violence. Neighbors are saying Thursday's killing comes off as a surprise. You have elderly people in the neighborhood, and you have people that don't, you know, get into any trouble or bother anybody. And for a killing to be this close is, you know, it's, it's very life changing. Shirley Busico, Fox 33 News. An update now on a deadly shooting in the Warner Park neighborhood. Shreveport police believe the shooting started with a dispute between a group of people on Mansfield Road yesterday afternoon. 30-year-old Tamel Henry was shot in the head and died in the hospital. Police believe 27-year-old Arkell Holmes Jr. is the man who pulled the trigger. He's wanted for second-degree murder. If you know where he is, call Crime Stoppers. A $2,000 reward is offered for his arrest.